Hey Tom, how are ya? Oh yeah, Tom.
Hey Brian, how are ya? Give me a second, I'm trying to figure out something here because uh, YouTube changed um, some configurations. So weird, so weird. Hold on, bring it back. Yeah, I don't know. Anyway, um, can you guys can hear me? I'm not sure if the screen is frozen or it's not frozen. It's not Hi, um, question, are you watching me through Twitch or through YouTube or Facebook? Uh, the thing is, I'm, I ha I'm having trouble with some connections. I don't know if where it is, so, so I'm just curious.
awesome. Thank you, thank you very much. All right, so Twitch is working. Thank you, thank you. Um, all right, so I'm just going to wait if someone types something on Facebook, uh, just to be sure. Although I noticed that the chat, uh, the window is like weird. We need to change that. Yeah, because that's way too big. Hold on, let me change that. Always something, always something. Every time someone decides to change, so it always makes a mess. Um, yeah, that chat box is way too big. So, what about. Sorry, would you mind typing type something on Twitch again, please? Uh, I made a change, so I just want to be sure that um, that the text appear properly. If you don't mind, please. the EMs. I mean, again, I haven't played this in a while. And I can really feel that it needs to be played. I don't know how to describe it. That's the thing with EMs. If you don't play them, uh, the switches, I don't know how to describe it. I mean, it's not that they become stiff. Or maybe that's the right word. But um, they feel different. I don't know. I don't know if it's like an old car. They need to be warm up. You know? So, but right now the feeling I get is like it feels cold. You know? I feel like the machine hasn't been warm up. I mean, also it's pretty cold here. And um, I'm sorry. I don't know, maybe it's just my impression. And that's the 100,000. So we got 100,000 there. Uh, 116,000, not bad. So yeah, if you guys can type something on the, on the Twitch chat, I will appreciate. Um, so I'm not sure if, it's, if now it's working or not. I just want to be sure that it's working. You know? right, let me check something. I know this is silly. All right, I have A there. Tap tap muse. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Uh, yeah, that's that's good. That's good. So at least it's connected. Again, I mean there were some changes on on Twitch, and uh, that the chat got messed up. And then at the same time, uh, I don't know what YouTube changed that I cannot stream on YouTube though. To figure that out, what's going on? We have enough today. Cause I have no idea what it changed, so I will need to make some tests. Yeah, but man. Again, I, in the what five minutes that I've been playing the game, and I feel it's getting warmer, uh, more responsive. I don't 
don't know how to describe it. Dennis, right? Hey, make a warrior. How are you, man? Thanks for, thanks for being here. How's it cold in Hagerstown, man? I don't think you guys got a lot of snow this time. Did you? Oh yeah, well, no, it's coming. It's coming from the west, I think. Yeah, it's coming from the west. Nope. The reason you see me like tiptoeing is because I have a camera right between the flippers and uh, the one that is pointed from the back last. So I need to tiptoe to see where the ball is. That's why it is a bit weird. A couple of inches, yeah, sort of here. Here actually maybe less. Maybe less than two inches, probably just one, but I think the problem will be just the eyes. I mean actually uh, Today our tournament, our weekly tournament was canceled because of that. Because the place we, we go close early, which makes sense. I mean, they don't want to have people driving. about this rubber this rubber can bounce all right um is anyone on facebook uh if there's anyone on facebook can you please type something on the chat i just want to see if um if the chat is working please uh, i think it's clear that it's not connected on facebook but i just want to be sure that uh that it's working through facebook and i know that there might be someone out there there's usually a couple of lurkers there. But anyway, uh, let's see. Well, this is a, such, a, such a different pace of game after playing the uh, Baywatch for two straight streams. It's good. Good. Well, at least other the reels reset which is good all right so four player game usually that's what usually i play always four player games but on the ems that actually keep keep the reels going for every all the four players
up for first ball, 63,000. It will be great if I can roll the scores of the four players in my game with three balls. I mean, it's doable. I think I already did it once in the first game. Roll the score. But it will be cool to do it with the four players in one game. Playing tiptoe. Hey Andrew, how are you, man? Thanks for stopping by. Hey, can you do me a favor? Would you mind please type something? Oh, there it is. Thank you. Thank you. Because I wasn't sure. Uh, a while ago. A while ago. Oh, okay, Andrew. Yeah, the thing is that earlier um, there were some changes on Twitch and YouTube and on Facebook on the configuration and kind of mess up something and uh, I wasn't getting chat working but now it's working uh, still I cannot stream into, into YouTube which I mean it's okay I mean there's not a lot of viewers over there at least I have not dedicated to create an audience there honestly mostly I use YouTube for archiving purposes you know but still I mean at some point I need to stream the three places at the same time so I need to figure that out why YouTube is not working I'm sure it's something silly
pressure. Woohoo! Not enough. Not enough to hold it. Ah, 95,000. Ah, 95,000. Not enough. 5,000 points short for 100. I think it's gonna be the goal for tonight. Of course. Trying to roll the scores in the four players in one game with three balls. Something else. Yeah, that's a that's a target bank that is not making the clean contact. Always something with these guys, really. If you don't use them. Hey Andrew, you guys got a lot of snow over there, or um, not too much, not too much. Oh, I'm sorry, Andrew. I just wanna, I just ask you, like, if you guys got a lot of snow over there or not.
that double bonus is pretty, pretty good. Give you a lot of points. That's pretty much what you want to achieve in this game. To get the double bonus. <laughs> yeah, exactly, exactly. They feel weird. I mean, it, it is it is hard to describe how they how they feel when they are cold. And uh, also because I haven't turned on this machine in a while, in a while. And uh, so maybe also that the fact that Ken is really cold here. And the funny thing is that the more I play. It kind of feels better, it's kind of, kind of coming back to life, maybe. I don't know, it's hard to describe, I think. Hard to describe. When you have like a pillow. <laughs> That's a good analogy. But yeah, but I, I'm noticing that there are a couple of things that they need to be adjusted. I mean, like the target bank, because obviously it's being reset, but the switch is not registering that. So that's pretty much just adjustment of the switch. because the ball is not gonna come out yeah. of course I won't tell it hey that I think that's a design for error because it's not the first time that I have seen on the M that the ball would get stuck on the target bank Raise the target. Uh, I don't think it's a matter of raising the target. Uh, the ball just get. I mean, how can I describe? I mean, target. A few targets look. They're down, and the ball just arrive and cook. Get stuck into the target. The side of the target. for stopping by playing some cold captain
there's a screw. Oh. I don't think it's a matter of height, Andrew. Uh, again, I mean, just think about it. There are a couple of targets. Let's say that the, 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 the row of five targets, let's say that these two are down, right? So if they are down, and if the ball just come here, I mean, at the right speed and everything, it will just sit there. I mean, obviously, if the balls come fast, it will bounce. But it just needs to be like at the right speed, like the right slow speed. Just one credit left. Uh, hopefully, I will get replace, so I don't have to open the door. I mean, I know I can open it. Just like, why? Earn a game. Earn it. You know? Sometimes, sometimes I think like, okay, if I have a quarter and I play, for how long I can play with that quarter? Either by gaining free uh, games by points or just by matching.
Passion bonus on I am is very, very satisfactory. Satisfactory? Pleasant? Do that. Take a picture of what just happened. Let's see. Um, hmm. All right, so I need to remove this camera. Hold on a second, it's gonna be a mess. Got wedge behind the target. Got wedge behind the target. I'll take a picture and I'll post it. I'll post it.
is not the first time that happened that uh, I will just hit, you know, the right angle and whoop, the ball just go. Oh well. Let's see. Let's, well, let's get back to this again. I think that's it. Oh, oh, oh. Four credits.
get a credit. Uh. Not bad, 58,000 bolt one. Yes. to keep the ball up. Hmm. Shoot. Turbo Graph, how are you man? Thanks for stopping by. We changed the pace now, the machine choice of tonight. We're going back to the roots. Oh, another root. Something less, less complicated. Well, I guess. Thanks, man. Thank you. Thanks for stopping by, man, again. Oh, man. So, uh, now here we are playing some good old Captain Fantastic. I think the, the objectives of today just to roll scores as many as we can. We already did a couple of times. It will be cool just to roll scores on all the four players. That will be cool though. Except for player one, player one has 62. So 40,000 points. Yeah. That ball just moonwalk into the ABC. Alright, player four, way four. Thanks for watching, man. Close Encounters. Um, it's a Godlift System 1, if I remember, right, Andrew? It's a funny theme, though. I mean, I think... I do love the movie, though, but... You know what draw me off of that machine? It's just a big alien on the playfield. It kind of creeped me out. Um... I'll take that. A wedge ball there. And then you're gonna I'm I'm sure you're gonna sell that machine, right? What 
what's the value of a close encounter nowadays? <laughs> This is stream is, is becoming Chronicles of Captain Fantastic. Oh my god. Oh man. This sucks. Take another picture. I know it's lame, but it's just like Chronicles of Captain Fantastic. Really. I mean, damn. thousand dollars damn thousand dollars from that did you change the boards or um, did you did you do any work on those boards oh well of course that ball is going out and I have how much I have in bonus I have 15,000 yeah maybe I'm gonna roll it all right ball one see ya all right so we roll layer one with 101 barely all right Conk. cook cook walk walk Turn out to be fine. I put new rubber, so it is probably going to run. I was thinking about routing it if it doesn't trade it. It looked nice, though. I mean, for the pictures that you posted, I didn't see anywhere on the play field. It looks pretty clean, though. It looks very, very clean.
means we got two, ga four games. We have another game, four games. Woohoo! All right, cool, cool. Thousand dollars, huh? Yeah. Yeah, I think in my case, I think I'm done uh, for Godlib System once after having Genie. I think I'm done with those. I mean, it, I like them and they're really nice games though, but um, I just keep changing, changing. Just, I just like to keep changing. All right, so now I remember why this machine is so loud because it doesn't have a back. That's why all the reels just sound so loud. All right, so let's see. So we have been rolling the scores at least once. So let's see if we can at least do with a couple of players to roll the scores. I mean, saying that let's roll the four players. That's a bit ambitious. Did you see that, Andrew? Did you see? That's what I was referring to. That the ball will travel at slow pace, slow speed, and they will just sit on a target comfortably. Just chill there, just like, oh, let me sit here and take a break. Silly ball. So yeah, so I don't think there is a way to fix that, honestly. I mean, if the ball wants to chill there, it's just gonna chill. Mm. Yeah, I'm just sitting there and um, just chilling. And, oh uh, well, well, I'm sure it's gonna tilt. Because this machine, it won't move, it won't, if I knock it, yeah, no, no way. If I try to smack it, I will break my arm before the ball comes out. There it is. Yeah, it's like trying to move a small refrigerator, well, not a small, like a big refrigerator. Shit. Look at 
slow death. Slow death. Bonk. Bonk. Oh. Again, again, oh my God, two times, two times. This is the second time. Oh, damn it. Uh, don't do that, don't do that. See, let's, let's see the ball on, ca on camera. Like, flip this and back. Goodbye. Goodbye. I have to the music. Oh, again, this seal application. And all right. So, what about if I do this now? All right. Music is a bit different now, the way how it's been listened. Let's see. Can you guys listen to music? Because I'm not sure if it's loud enough or it's.
got a game. An extra game. All right, 87,000 points. Still short for 100. Again, again. <sighs> again, 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 again. Oh boy. Woohoo! I got three games, three extra games. Alright, so I'm gonna play those three extra games that I earn. Three games, three player games. Let's see if I can earn more game. Nope. At this pace, I don't think so. Hey, Amanda, how are you? Thanks for stopping by. Excellent. Too hard. Boo. 
Oh, oh. oh man. series of games. And this is a double bonus in the gate. One game. Or I'm gonna play that game, that only game. Let's see if I can get these two games. One by points and another by match. Maybe. Extra game is around seventy thousand points, maybe or sixty thousand. No games. No games. Damn it. Alright, so I have to add manually games. Boo! That means that with my quarter, I will be out heading home with no ice cream. Alright. This is so sketchy. Twenty credits for now. It's way too loud. Way too loud. All right, so well, let's keep doing. Let's keep doing something. One, two, three, and four.
Jesus. Ah. Thanks for the follow. Thanks for the following. Holy Jesus. Thanks for the follow. On a second I will get your name. I need to put my glasses on. That's what happens when you age. You need to carry your glasses everywhere, which sucks. Your readers. Thanks for the follow. Thank you very much. Appreciate it. Silly ball. Go there. Go there. Go there. Sixty six thousand, all right, for ball one. And an extra ball. All right. Keep doing it. Three thousand, so it's okay. I think we can roll that guy, maybe. Ugh. 
uh, 38,000 player one. So. That was a nice ball. That was a nice ball. 130,000. That's a nice ball, though. Mm. So, with that, kids, if you propose something, you can achieve it. Dream big. <laughs> All right, so, where are we? All right, so we're still on player one. We're gonna play the extra ball. Still on player two. All right. <laughs> Thanks for the cheering, Amanda. <laughs> Thanks for the cheering. <laughs> Thanks for the love and the comprehension. <laughs> All right. Good. 
So we got those in there, right? Got the gates open. So 142, 142 for player one. Okay. Wow, player three, eighty-three thousand. So yeah, we might roll that guy also. Maybe. If I don't blow it, like my, like how we used to. just turn off the machine you know but okay um so 106 so 106 we got for player three all right all right so, let's see. so we are ro we have rolling two players now thousand so that's okay well, it's funny that's a Spanish This face is because of, of the lyrics of the song. That's weird. That's a weird song. A weird song. Hey Francis, how are you man? Thanks for stopping by. So ball three for player two, 65,000. We're still 35,000 short for rolling player two.
not enough. Not enough to roll it. Oh, boy. oh. yes, we roll it. All right. So we roll player one, player two, and player three. We roll three scores in one game with three balls and uh, one extra ball and one. It's nice. Yeah, player four, trying to roll the score also on player four is going to be hard. It is 20,000 points. So it's, I need to make 80,000 points. Well, I mean, doable, but, well, if it's hard. But hey, rolling three scores. Yeah. In the same game. This thing's fine. thousand points Whew. so final score was for player one 167,000 player two was 104,000 and player three was 113,000 and player four was 60,000 points it's not bad not bad not bad not bad It's a weird song, that one in Spanish. It's a weird song. Still playing that one? Yes. So, okay, we have we kind of done almost done the goal of uh, rolling, rolling the scores with the four players in one game. So we have done three. So. Let's see if we can do it. I mean, don't get me wrong. I'm happy with rolling, rolling the score three times in one game. I'm happy with that. Let me sit. So I, have a, I don't have my glasses. All right. So, all right. It's eleven. All right. So we have twenty-one credits left. Um, twenty-one games left. I mean, credits. So that means I put twenty. I put twenty. Damn, I did. I got a lot of free games now. I mean, I will say, let's play until I run out of credits. That means 21 games. It's a lot of games. Let's see how far we go.
Arch Ball. All right, Amanda, have a good night. Thanks for stopping by. Thank you. Have a good night. I'll see you later.
50,000 for player one. for player two. player three. Oh boy, alright. 78,000 was the highest score. Let's try again. Four players. 18 games left. Ah. If 
the ball wants to go, the ball will go. No doubt. Oh my god. That's such a stupid move. He does. All right. Uh, let's try again. Try again. Fifteen more games. Still fifteen more credits left.
Tilt. Damn it. Damn it. That's such a good bonus. Alright. It is what it is, I guess. Five thousand, okay.
Damn it. Let me refill my bottle of water. I'll be back in a sec. Nothing. Nothing really in this end. Two, three, four. Eleven games to go. Eleven credits available. Fourth time that the ball get trapped there. Other than I need to tilt. <laughs> Damn, bro. Target. Damn you, target. Thank you. 
again. Ball. Gee. There it is. Ball through right there. Six thousand. That's it. Gee, all right. Right again. All right, a couple of minute break. So who's out there? Um, I know that there's some people out there watching, so could you just type hi or like yo something? Take a couple of minutes break because we have been playing for what now, like almost two hours and 30 minutes. So it's a little bit tired. There you go. There's someone out there typing. Who are you? That kid, hey man, how are you? Why so quiet? Why so quiet? Um, you know, it gets too quiet. Some, sometimes it gets just too quiet.
Oh, so you're getting getting ready for your ba your basement. Oh my god, that's that's great. Hey, thanks for thanks for stopping by, man. Thank you, thank you very much, man. Well, that's great, man. That's great that you're preparing space for your for your paints. That's that's great. Just be be sure that you have enough electricity for it. Because sometimes that's what a lot of people oversee. Especially if you're gonna have like multiple machines running at the same time. You want to be sure that your electric system is strong enough to hold them. Otherwise your circuit breaker is gonna jump all the time. Thanks for the follow man. Thanks for the follow. Yeah, I remember when I was um, doing my basement. Um, actually, that was one of the last things that I remember when I was working with the electrician and uh, that the electric. Because he asked me actually, like, what you're gonna plug here? And uh, I totally oversee that the electric part. And he said, yeah, you, you will you will need more lines and more circuit breakers if you want to run all the machines at the same time. So yeah, that's definitely something that you need to check with your electrician. Delaware Pinball, hey man, how are you? Thanks for stopping by. Yeah, the machine looks clean. I mean, but the funny thing though is that at the beginning of the stream, um, I felt the machine kind of like cold. I don't know, it's hard to describe it. I mean, the last time I played this machine was probably November maybe. I mean, it has been a while, a while that I don't turn on the machine at all. And uh, when I start playing it today, it's just like, I don't know. I don't know really how to describe it, but it was like cold, like stiff maybe. I don't know. Uh, there were some targets that they were not registering scores and uh it's still i think i have a problem with the target bank because it's not registering the points when i hit them or actually randomly will register so definitely something with the switch um but it was it's fun so i was just saying that yeah with ems pretty much you have to play them otherwise they will just get all stiff you know like an old person and yeah it's funny with these guys but yeah, definitely, like you said, a 20 amp circuit. Um, I don't know, honestly, I mean, I'm not an electrician, but I know that uh, if I remember, uh, there is a, there is an outlet for one outlet, I mean, with two outlets for every 20, 20 amp breaker here. Um, so I remember the electrician asked me, okay, so how much power these machines consume? And I wasn't sure at the moment. And um, he said, okay, let's go. Let, let's put up an outlet and let's run one, one circuit breaker per outlet, just to be sure. But de definitely that's something that you want to take a look at it uh, with the electricity. Um, because obviously, as we know, I mean, these machines are, especially the old ones, it's a fire hazard. And uh, every time I, uh, I'm out for vacation, let's say for a long period of time, I will actually unplug them from the wall. I mean, yeah. But yeah, definitely, it's, I mean, yeah, it's a fire hazard, like it or not, I guess. Hey Pepper, so seven. Thanks, thanks for stopping by. Hello. Finally, we can have some uh, some interaction a little bit on the chat. It was just way too quiet. Uh, I have been playing Captain Fantastic now for what is it, like two hours and thirty minutes now. So yeah, so I'm just having a little break here. Holy shit, 21 games? <laughs> That's a lot of games. On four circuits, 220, yeah. Yeah, honestly, I mean, I have no idea how, how's the formula when it comes to, like, to estimate all the power. But you just want to be sure that 
I mean that everything is up to code and legit, like no sketchy jobs, you know. Um, yeah, you don't want to have a electric problem or electric fire in your house, like knock on wood, knock on wood. It's something that I don't wish to anyone. But uh, yeah, you have to be, you have to play safe. And and again, I mean in my case, I will, I unplug the machines. I unplug my machines when I'm out, out of town. Um, never know man never know with these guys you know captain fantastic was one of the first games you played that's awesome at least a great game also at least a great game gameplay is nice I'm not a very fan of the theme though uh, or the art itself Maybe because I'm not a fan of boxing, and uh, but the game, the game is nice. It's really, really nice. I think that era of Sterns are great. I used to have a Meteor and the Stars, and I love them. I, I love that old uh, old Stern. I played about uh, maybe a month ago or a friend's house uh, Nine Ball from Stern. Oh my God, it's such a fun game! Such a fun game, Nine Ball. Also from Stern, from the same era. And it's fast, it's a fast game. It's a fast game. Nine ball. From Stern. Yeah, Stars is a great game, that I work in both. Great game. Uh, yeah, in, in my case, I mean, I mean, I, there's a star on location. I sold my star to to stars for good friends, so I know I can go to her house and play. Uh, but definitely, stars is a great game. I mean, spinners, both the spinners are great. And when you collect the the star, the wow target, the wow target, is so it, it gives so much satisfaction when you when you collect the wow targets. Which is pretty much the same on a meteor or, or any other stern that has a wow target. It's, it gives you such a great satisfaction when you get it. Yeah, Crapton still have their stars. Still, still, they're still they still have their the stars there. It is a great game. I mean, again, that era of of stern. I mean, it's a great, a great era, great era of machines in that time. Jackpot, yeah, jackpot, yeah, that's that's yeah, jumping to a different era, definitely jumping to a different era. You know, I'm not a, I'm, I don't know, I mean, honestly, I haven't had the time to play on jackpot. I know that you can do a lot of things, and you can, uh, I mean, I have seen, uh, I remember a friend of mine. I used to have one, and honestly, I, I never pay attention on the rules of it. Thanks for the follow, Peppers. Thanks for the follow. And um, but yeah, I think in, in that case, I mean, because what is it? It's Pinbot, Bride of Pinbot, and Jackbot. That trilogy. I think I will stick with Pinbot. You know, that's the one that I will stick. Um, Bride of Pinbot. It doesn't do anything to me, honestly. Uh, and I don't know, Jackpot is kind of like a modern pinbot. So it's kind of weird with a DMD. I don't know, maybe because I'm so used to a pinbot. And having a DMD pinbot, which is now Jackpot, is like weird. And Bride of Pinbot is just like, uh, it never grew on me. It never grew on me. Uh, on location here on. Uh, there's a Bride of Pinbot 2.0 and Still, you know, still, I mean, I don't know. I'm not a hundred percent sold on it But well, I don't know It is true, and Bride of Pinbot is a one-shot game, I mean, for the billionaire, right? It's the billionaire club, if I remember correctly. And, uh, yeah, Pinbot and Jackbot, yeah, it's it's more risk game. 
Uh, but I think on, on Jackpot you have to the option of betting or cashing, stuff like that. I don't know, it just gets more complex and uh, for me, I like more simple, simple games as you can see. I like, I like more the geometry, maybe, that's what you can call it, the geometry of a simple game. Uh, like even the simple geometry of a game like this one can whoop your butt, right? Or Paragon, for instance. Paragon is, is one of my it's my favorite my, it's my favorite game, Paragon, uh, which is next to this one. And um, Paragon is a simple game, but it's brutal. I mean, it's brutal, and it's because of the geometry of the game itself. Yeah, I mean, there's for everything, you know. I mean, uh, yesterday, for instance, I played, uh, I streamed um, Baywatch. And um, before that, I streamed Demolition Man. And uh, I streamed last year a lot of Star Trek. And yes, there's a lot of things to do, a lot of things to do. Uh, but, you know, sometimes I just want to turn on the machine play a simple game, not think about strategies or anything, and just play, you know, just get my ass whooped, and that's it, um, I don't know, it depends on the mood how I feel, you know, it depends on the mood, like, for instance, um, I didn't know the whole rules of Baywatch until the last two times that I streamed, and, uh, one thing, though, is that I don't like to set up goals, you know, I mean, yesterday, for instance, my goal was to get into the wizard mode of Baywatch, which, which was Earthquake, which is Earthquake. And uh, I did it, I did it, but you know, I just don't like that. I just don't like that to go, go, go for a goal, you know? And uh, I don't know, I mean, I was like, you get frustrated, blah, blah. But sometimes, I mean, in my case, I just like to just step into a machine, put a quarter, two quarters, a dollar, and just play and that's it obviously i mean yes it helps when you know the modes or the rules blah 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 for a tournament or something like that but casual playing yeah i just don't want to be stressed you know like okay now i have what i have to do just flip 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 keep the ball alive like i always said you know keep the ball alive Yeah, full throttle, full throttle is a fun game, I remember that, full throttle. But yeah, Paragon can make you angry, yeah, 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 it can make you angry. I remember with Paragon, actually, that's a machine that I learned how to tap pass. And uh, I find that uh, Bali's, Bali's are great machines to learn how to tap pass. And uh, yeah, a great game though, great game. That's cool, man. That's that's fine, man. I mean, again, yes, it's nice to set up your initials and everything. I mean, but you know, I mean, again, there are some games that the rules are so complex. I mean, it's like a Jersey Jack, Wizard of Oz, just as an example. Fuck, you need a book. You need to really to study the rules of that. Like, no, 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 no. It's a game. I mean, it's a hobby. I mean, I mean, you play to relax, to have a good time, not to study. I mean, that's that's for college or for work, not for a hobby. I mean, like, no, no, no. I mean, my case, it will just stress the hell out of me, and maybe I'm just too lazy to put time on learning a manual of a pinball. You know, I mean, I will go to the basics maybe, but that's it. That's it. I mean. 
On tournaments, definitely. I'm, I'm just very laid really back, very chill. Uh, if I lose, I lose. If I win, I win. And um, but yeah, I never get into the the game phase. You know, like I'm gonna chop your head off and spit. Nah, never, never got into that. Never. I rather more enjoy the game itself than going and trying to chop the head off of my opponent. Nah, that's not fun for me. You know, it's not fun for me. I like to play, and if I play well, yay! If I play bad, yay! And it's okay. Alright, so let me play here a little bit before it's getting late. Yeah, Hobbit for instance, a friend of mine has one. I don't know, maybe just because I don't follow this, I didn't follow the, the series or the movie. Yeah, I just don't get it. I mean, no doubt that Jersey Jack machines are beautiful. They're beautiful machines. Yeah. That I have no doubt. Hello Gilf, thanks for watching this late night stream of uh, Captain Fantastic. Sort of boss. I mean, it's, it's a beautiful machine. It's a beautiful machine. I mean, I remember when it came out for the first time, it was like a eye wide open, you know, I'm like wow. I mean, a great uh, light show. But yeah, when it comes to the shots, not a lot. But hey, if you're a fan of Dorothy and Toto, by all means, you know. Yeah, no doubt, Jersey Jack really built really nice looking machines. That for sure. I don't, I don't think there's no question about that. collection comes and goes our pinball um, usually there's a pool of machines and I get to bring machines and machines come out so pretty much right now right now at this precise moment I have how many Four. Uh, 
I have nine machines right now. Um, but usually I am between 12 and 15, usually. Um, actually, Bow and Arrow is leaving. It's leaving soon. Baywatch is leaving. And I think I'm getting on Thursday, maybe, uh, Adam's Family, Indiana Jones, Terminator, Terminator 2, Wizard, and Supersonic. Those are coming in. And uh, so, yeah. So, yeah, so usually I, I rotate all my machines pretty, pretty often. Oh, really? Huh. So it was well, it was bad. Oh, so you got a, the target alpha. Trying to remember now. Yes. Oh my God. Yeah. Do you do you find the issue with that target alpha? Actually. Well, that makes sense, Peppers. Yeah, if you wait for so long and then the machine got problems, yeah, I'm sure it makes sense to be mad at it. Yeah, I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry, you got you got problems with delivery, man. Target off. I remember that machine now. Please tell me that didn't end up on a dumpster, that target alpha. What? <laughs> you got rid of it? What? My heart just broke a little bit. Damn it. I thought like, when? I would reconnect. Oh man, you saw that. I have a soft spot for EMs, but yeah, fixing them. Oh my god. I don't know, man. My last project, uh, EMs was bow and arrow and uh, what's the name? Mars Trek from Sonic. Uh, Mars Trek wasn't that bad, but bow and arrow, oh boy, it was bad. And uh, but yeah, that actually is working, and that goes to Crap Town. That bow and arrow. Alright Peppers, have a good night. Thanks for stopping by again. Thanks for the follow. Oh wow, yeah, that's a lot of problems. That's a lot of problems for a new inbox machine.
This is like the fifth time that the ball will get stuck on the target. Oh my God. Yeah, Jersey Jack make that one. Oh man. Tilt, of course. Give me a second, I need to go to the bathroom for a sec. Give me a sec. Oh well. Alright, so where are we? Player three. <laughs> All right, that's our pinball. Have a good night. Thanks for stopping by. And yes, let's hope that the snow stay away. But I think we're getting some snow over the weekend, though. I think on Friday. I think that you two, you guys, will have us some snow. I think. Maybe. I don't know.
Six credits left. All right. Uh, let's see. camera right between the flippers. Maybe sixth time and the ball will get trapped in the target. Fantastic. You're not being that fantastic, though.
Hey, Andrew, how are you, man? Good to see you, man. Good to see you. Yeah, I need to work on some switches. Um, I mean, I haven't played this machine in a while, and as I was saying before, if you don't play EMs often, they get all wonky. So, yes, I need to go through the switches. Mostly uh, the target bank. Target bank, sometimes it will register when you hit it, sometimes not. And uh, it is registering. I mean, it knows when the targets come down, but it doesn't register the 500 points. Hey, Pinball Undesirable, thanks for the raid. Thank you very much for the raid. Yeah, thank you, thank you, man. I appreciate, man. I appreciate the love, and the raid. Awesome. How are you, man? By the way. Ah. So, Andrew, did you guys get a lot of snow up there? Dance, Dance Revolution? No, man. No, no, no. no. Oh, so you found you found new people to show pinball to on Twitch. All right, so you recruit new people. That's what you're saying. It's awesome. That was no in Alabama. <laughs> You're lucky, man. You are lucky. Time delay is horrible. <laughs> oh, man. All right, so we have still six more credits left. Alabama. Man, I, I wish that warm, the warm weather would believe me. I really wish that. The southern weather. <laughs> that's awesome, PBU man. That's awesome, man. New recruits, new recruits. That's great, man. To show them uh, pinball thing. You facage, facage. You have facage. Thanks for the follow. Thank you. Thank you very much for the follow. All right. It's so funny because, you know, I kind of feel like my stream is like the after hours thing. Because usually people arrive always around this time. I really feel like this is the after hours. It's funny. Here, what is it? It is, yeah, 12, what? 12.20, yeah. I'm here. I have been here since, what, 9, 9 p.m.? So I have been streaming Captain Fantastic for three hours. Three hours straight of Captain Fantastic. So, yeah, I'm getting, I'm getting tired and also it's getting late here. So I went through, a, like, a lot of credits. I think I, I started the game with, uh, I think, 20 credits. 
And then I played and I earned some games, and blah, blah. So pretty much right now I'm down to two, two more, two more credits. And I think then I'm going to just call it a night. So if you are connected, please come and come, please come early, earlier actually. Because if you just arrive, I'm about to leave. Maybe in the next, I don't know, maybe 15 minutes, maybe. Depend how bad I play. So Andrew, you were saying that you just got a Captain Fantastic? That's awesome, Andrew. That's great, man. That's great. So I'm assuming that it will need some work, right? I'm assuming. Like any other EM. Oh, oh. Like any other EM, right? Yeah, the Facebook chat is kind of slow. So you turn it on and the fuse is blown. So maybe it's just a short somewhere. Yeah. Oh. A short word, where could be? You turn it on, could be on the GI. Well, depend what depend of the sh depend of the fuse, depend what type of the voltage of the that is the fuse that is being blown. Because when you turn on the machine, what it comes is the GI. 
I mean, when you actually flip the switch, not when you start a game. If that's what you mean. When you flip the power, the power button. I would think if, if, if a fuse is blown, maybe it's on the GI, because that's the only thing that gets turned on. Maybe, maybe. Uh, unless there's a, an actual short on the main power line. The one that actually comes into the transformer. Energized. I mean, no, no power at all. Mm, usually, the bonus. The bonus really doesn't get energized at all. So usually, that's a cert. I mean, it doesn't. It doesn't count, or it doesn't pay the bonus. Because it might be different, I mean, it might be different, the source of power. Because, for instance, on bow and arrow, for instance, bow and arrow, the bonus, the bonus really gets triggered by the out hole, I mean, by the, what's it called, the hole, the out hole, I mean, when you, the saucer, it gets energized from there. So, it depends, it depends. If in your Hocus Pocus it doesn't advance bonus or it doesn't pay out bonus. Because if it doesn't make the payout and it's not being energized, hmm. I don't know, I wanted to see the diagram. It might be also a broken wire, don't get me wrong. It might be a broken wire. I had a problem with. Uh, Mars Trek with a couple of broken wires. Also, the bonus doesn't stop. That's what you mean. So when it comes to payout, it just like go 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 go. In that case, the switch, because there's a switch actually on the bonus wheel that will make the bonus stop. The bonus wheel to stop. If that's the case, I mean, I don't know. Alright guys, so I got my four last credits. Let's play the last game, and then I'll call it the night. gets back to zero all right so just as an example so let's say that you have 10,000 as a bonus right ball gets drained and it will be stuck on whatever bonus you are and it will give you let's in this in this way 
in this case, let's say it's a stock in 10,000. It will give you 10,000, 10,000, 10,000, 10,000. If that's what you mean. Also, actually, the solenoid, the solenoid doesn't click, 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 click. Um, it could be the out hole. Uh, because our, the, it's not a game over, really. Could be the out hole because actually the the switch that is in the trout that detects when the when you drain the ball that's the one that actually make tell the other relays hey this dude lose his ball make the bonus count so i will start following wires from there on the diagram from the switch that is on the trout and then work my way up um but again it could be a broken wire andrew Yeah, 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 now I got it. So yeah, I will, I mean, what I will try, I mean, with some alligator clips, try to, if you manually energize the coil, like with alligator clips, uh, actually it will go down and it will stop at the switch. If you manually power the coil. Because if you can manually power the coil, you just need to go into the diagram and to see, okay, backtrack, like from that coil, what's, if you follow the trace, just backtrack, and from that relay, you can, with an alligator, with alligator wire, you can actually, like, jump it. Because again, it could be just a broken wire. And... I mean, I know it's a lot of trial and error, believe me, I mean, but um, I will start with that because when it comes to the bonus, I mean, it's like, for instance, like this machine, I mean, if I have some bonus, it will cash when the switch in the trout, it detects a ball. That's the one that it will send the signal like, yo, put are working so I will back trace from there from the switch that is in the trout and I think they call it out hole I think I think they call it out hole really? I don't remember exactly um, I think Bali and Williams called the same So at least you don't have a problem with the scores, with the score model. Because sometimes you can see the relay actually moving the bonus wheel, but nothing gets gets a score. So that put that the, the score your score motor is fine. So I think it is. I think I think what I will do is pretty much that. Just from the from the switch that is in the trout. Follow follow the diagram. Follow the the wires on the diagram. And I'm sure you will find at some point the bonus, the bonus coil. Because again, that's the one that trigger power to that coil. Because honestly, score motors, I mean, that's like black magic. I don't get score motors. That's, that's like voodoo, man. 
are things from the devil. Score motors. Oh. Yeah, score motors are weird. Yeah, I think I think first thing is just to get power to that coil. I think that's the first thing to do. And um, yeah, then probably I don't know. Maybe you have to you have you have to work on the on the bonus wheel, which is very simple to be honest. A bonus wheel. I mean, it's just a wheel with the spider. And uh, probably I mean, of course I mean if it's counting, probably your contacts are fine. If if the light on the play field, you're seeing your contacts will be fine. Um, Yeah, I was trying to think. Uh, yeah, I think definitely I will start with getting power into that coil. And uh, once you identify what's wrong, which probably it's a wire, a broken wire. And um, okay, next, what is doing and work, work from there. But the actual bonus wheel is very, very simple. I mean, it has a relay. Um, it's a... Uh, if I remember, it's just a one. It has one relay. It should have one, one relay because it reset pretty much gets back to zero because of the tension of the springs. The springs are the ones that put them back into zero. The tension of the springs. Yeah, because when the when the coil is fired, chuk chuk chuk, it goes up. So I'm just trying to trying to remember the the score the the bonus wheel or it goes there there are two i don't remember if it's in like an infinite wheel or just one for advance and one for you know advance for i don't remember exactly i want i wanted to check the diagram i mean it's like almost 1 a.m so like don't expect <laughs> I don't expect me to be accurate, but definitely I will start with powering that coil, and again with some alligator clips. So if at some point work, maybe it's a switch, man. Maybe maybe it's called solder on a switch, man. If it worked, maybe. I mean, you know, just wiggle, wiggle the terminals, and just try to pull the wire. Because because if it worked. I mean, I don't know if when you were testing, I don't know if a wire got moved and if it was broken, it got just connect again. Because obviously these wires are so dry and stiff that when you move them, when you wiggle them, sometimes 
and they reconnect again. I mean, not securely, but maybe, maybe just a cold solder on the switch, man. Tuesday at 1 a.m. What you mean, man? You know, it's it's not easy. It is not easy. I mean, yeah, you have to be in the right mood to to work on the AM. I mean, also, but I'm hoping that it's something simple, man. I mean, try to manually give power and to see if that make it stable. You know. Because if giving power, I mean like you manually give power with some alligator clips and it works and you play and it works, definitely, definitely was a wire. But even after, after you give power manually, still with problems, I will, I will go for a switch, a switch problem maybe. Maybe the contacts, because remember, yeah, maybe you have maybe you have the switch but who knows if it has still the contacts those tiny small pieces in the contact itself because sometimes on the EMs those tiny things of tungsten it's called the material they just are worn down I mean, who knows man more credits I guess all right so uh, the machine gave me two more credits so two more games and that's it so I can leave the machine with zero credits so a two-player two player game that's it
it. No more games. No more games. Well, I think that one of the goals that I set up at the beginning of the stream was to roll, roll the scores and uh, try to get the four players to roll the scores in the same game and I was able to make three players. So I had a one game that I was able to score, to roll the scores with three players except for one. So I'm fine, I'm happy with it. It was good, it was good to play some Captain Fantastic for three hours and 30 minutes, which is a lot. So, I know there's a couple of things that I need to address on this machine after over two months of not turning it on at all. But, uh, but still holding, still holding, and, uh, still hard. But anyway, I'm out of here. So, anyway, alright guys, so let's call it a night. I'm gonna sleep, gotta work tomorrow, like everybody else, I'm hoping. And um, I think I'll be back, when is it, today is Tuesday or Wednesday, uh, maybe, maybe Friday, maybe, I don't know, and uh, if you guys follow me on Twitter or Instagram or here on Facebook, usually that's, that's where I announce when I'm going to stream, so subscribe, and uh, We'll see you later. All right, guys. Thanks for everybody for stopping by. Have a good night. See ya.